Have you been struggling to hit masters lately? You lose. <laughs> Maybe you think it's your moms you're using, or even worse, your teammates. But don't even worry, because in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to hit masters in 9 hours if you haven't already. So stay tuned. Now, there's several people you can use to go ahead and find your success into that master's rank. But for me, it was only three of them. Two mains and a little surprise for y'all at the end. So you make sure you stay there today. So I got a good one for y'all. Because first, we got Tree. Now, I know y'all seen in the tournaments how he's been going off. Man, that Woodhammer Horn Leech, that's actually a menace. All these EX mods can't handle that. What can you do when you're stunned for three seconds straight? Nothing but get jumped by our homies. Two, you can also go up Curse Horn Leech. I mean, I did that. That seemed pretty cool to be able to get your reset off Horn Leech. Keep pushing them back into the enemy team. It's also more stuns and you're still getting heals from it too. So both ways is good. I didn't really try to use Pain Split. It's not going to work out that well. I mean, maybe if you in the trios, we didn't do much of that neither. Solo queued our way through. The thing is with early season, if you solo queue, you most likely going to get bots too to help you out with some of those rough patches that you may be going through now second we over here with our big bro y'all know slow bro has to pop out now i don't know why we didn't see him in the tournament much but he sure did do a hell of a lot for me as y'all see here we didn't use amnesia you gotta use telekinesis again like we said with tree it's all about cc right now so when you get telekinesis you're gonna hold him in the air your team can blast them trash him and put his ass outside or you can bring him closer and still get to kill yourself and make sure you go and surf people because skull it used to be that thing but right now we need to slow some people down okay let our homies get up in where they fit in you feel me now i know y'all probably sitting there like yo wally that's two defenders bro like how you telling me to just run that what's up with the attackers don't fret that's where our third one's coming into play. Now, most people I've seen do pretty good with Mimikyu. I've seen people do even good with Phalanx. But I think the one that's going to take the cake here is Zacian. Now, before everyone starts saying, oh, wait, hold up, it's Maridon. Now, Maridon also too, but when Maridon comes in and you clap, 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 pap him, he ain't getting out of that. Zacian can get out of that and still come back while you chasing him. Boom, I hit you with a crit. Now you dead. Now he's still getting out of there. So y'all go ahead and let me know in the comments how y'all feel about that. Now I am a little bit biased because I'm a defender main. But CC is king here. We can't all be attackers because then who's going to front line? Then we're just going to sit there and complain. I've been Wally and I did it in nine hours. You can too. You need some help, call up on me and I'ma come scoop you. Haha. <laughs> Love y'all, man. Peace.